What's up guys, welcome to Here's Avenue, my name is Darren and today we are talking about Green Lantern because HBO Max, as you know, they are currently developing a, a Green Lantern series with a movie-like budget and so far they have casted two people uh, to play as Green Lantern and, uh, and, and previously we got our Guy Gardner um, with uh, Finn Whitrock and now we finally got our Alan Scott. So let me go ahead and just read you this article from Cinema Cinema Blend, and um, and this is what they say. They said, HBO Max Green Lantern series has been in development for a while, and it appears as though a character set to appear in a series has been confirmed. After it was revealed that Finn Whitrock would appear as the iconic Guy Gardner, a report has surfaced that another Hollywood name is in discussions to play another one of Emerald Knights. Actor Jeremy Irvine as hero Alan Scott. It could happen. So he is currently in talk. So it's not totally confirmed yet. Um, you know, sometimes these these don't are sometimes, you know, in, in most cases they, they do follow through, but there are situations where, you know, negotiation negotiations don't don't work and then, you know, they, they cast someone else. Um, but I would I would put my money on that this guy is going to be Alan Scott. I personally thought they would cast an older fellow uh, to be cast at Alan Scott because Alan Scott, as you know, he's an older guy because um, he came from, you know, from the um, some just from just society. And so, it, you know, that was back in, you know, in 1940s, 1950s. And so he, he, he typically, especially in the comics, he is, portray, uh, you know, portrayed as an older guy. But, you know, ever since, you know, New 52 and the Earth 2 comic book, they did reboot the character and made him a gay character and much younger as well. So this is going to be a very different, very different um, Alan Scott that you know a lot of people aren't aware of. You know, a lot of people still don't know that Alan Scott, you know, is gay now in, in the comic book. So a lot of people don't know that. So uh, let me go ahead and just continue on the article. They said Alan Scott is the first human Green Lantern in DC comic lore, irrelevant in terms of the fact that. As of the last decade, he's one of the he's one of DC's more notably gay characters. In fact, it's already been confirmed that Scott, who's been around since 1940, will be gay in the upcoming HBO Max series. So there your there's your confirmation. So the article uh, kind of also touches on you know we still have four more members of the Green Lantern cast to, to get casted, uh, which is Simon Bass, Jessica Cruz, Sinestro, and then Kilowog. Of Obviously, Kilowog is going to be a voiceover because he's a giant bulldog pig um, alien. So that's going to be a voiceover. But I'm very curious on who are they going to cast as Sinestro, as Simon Baz, and Jessica Cruz. Um, a very odd group of people to make a Green Lantern series out of uh, just because they are they are definitely unknown. I mean, Sinestro, Sinestro and Kilowog are more, no, more known than Simon Baz and Jessica Cruz just because they're so new. Um but very interesting. I, I I assume they're they're leaving Hal Jordan and John Stewart. They're leaving them for the movies because they are very huge IPs, as you guys know, because of the Zack Snyder cut. You know, they wanted they wanted um, you know Zack Snyder to hold off on you know revealing John Stewart because they have more plans for John Stewart characters uh, in the future of DC. So um, we we're curious on how everything goes. Um, like I said. I didn't expect a younger Alan Scott. Uh, I am ex very excited for the Guy Gardner, though. Guy Gardner is one of my, you know, like Green Lantern Corps isn't Green Lantern without Guy Gardner. That guy is that guy is crazy. He's funny. He's he's brutal. He has he, you know he he has a lot of attitude. Um, there's this one fight that I really loved with him and Atrocitus in in one of the Green, Green Lantern issues, and they just went at it. Like, Atrocitus is is always going to be like one of those brawler characters in the in the Green Lantern lore, um, and he's very like terrifying. But also, Green Lantern, a uh, uh, Guy Gardner is too. So seeing those two go out in the comic books, it it was so bloody that it was such a great issue. So I'm like very excited for this series just because Green Lantern has so much potential to be good, so much potential, and it was such a tragedy that. You know, the 2011 version was bad. Such a tragedy. I was super hyped for it. Uh, so I'm hoping the second go is successful because, you know, it could be a really great series 
and it could launch off to a really great franchise. So, um, so yeah, I'd love to know you guys' thoughts. Who would you guys cast as Jessica Cruz and Simon Baz and, and Sinestro? Let me know in the comments below. Like this video, subscribe to our channel, and I'll see you guys again. Bye.